Hi, I'm Rita Peterson with Everything Homemade and I am here um, to teach you what I do, how to bottle my kombucha. Um, it's really, really simple, but let's first um, start with um, the bottles. Very, very important part. First, you are looking for glass. Um, I don't like using canning jars because of the shape of the canning jar and the, the lid is metal. Well, this actually has a plastic um, piece in it, in the lid. So this is my favorite bottle. Now what I did was I went down to Superstore, I walked down the aisle looking for um, a bottle, not caring what was in it, just looking for the shape. And these are Prairie A um, carbonated water, um, the bottles. Uh, and I just took the labels off um, what I liked was the shape. Now the shape looks like a beer, um, a glass beer um, container, and that's what you want. You want it to taper up because this will give that fizz, that carbonation effect um, in about three or four days in the fridge. So that's what I do. Plus these were inexpensive and I could also buy them at Costco or at Superstore. I mean, they're all over the place. So I love these bottles. Um, the other thing, what, what you need here for, for bottling is you have your finished kombucha, your bottles, you need about 10 of these per a gallon about. I have a, a strainer and then what I have is a funnel and another strainer that is more fine to catch the fine herbs the second time. I have another bowl and I have a glass um, measuring cup and you want everything to be glass. You don't want a bottle in um, plastic or metal because this is acidic and you don't want it to be contaminated or pull harmful toxins from the metal and the plastic into your body. So let's do this. So first of all, you dump your kombucha in here. Perfect. So you can let this strain a little bit longer for, but for the sake of the video, I'm just going to put it in my bowl. And then what you want to do, all you do is fill it up. Now I'm going to show you why I do a double strain here in a moment. Get a little bit more in there. Is you get some more herb out, okay? And so I like a really, really clean drink. And when I serve it, I serve this always to my friends and family when they come over, my guests, and and I want it to be really, really clean. So I always do a double strain um, all the time, no matter what I'm soaking with. So we were just we're just going to continue to bottle here. Um, we have two gallons to do. I'll put it in the fridge, and you'll notice in about five days that carbonation to happen. We drink it be, before it gets really fizzy. My kids always find it fun. The beginning of the week, it's not as fizzy. And at the end of the week, it gets fizzier as, as the days go by. So that is how simple it is to bottle your kombucha.